Okay, so today we are cleaning out clothes that I don't fit no more because I'm thick now. <laughs> just kidding. No, I seriously have clothes that really just do not fit me for real, for real. And it's no reason to keep them because it's not even like, it's not that I'm not going to lose weight because I actually like this new weight on me. So I'm not really trying to lose weight, but I'm just not trying to keep clothes that I'm not going to fit ever again anyway. Over here. I have just some bins of like lounge clothes, not really dressy clothes yet. That's going to be stuff in the closet. So I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. I have 12 bins total. There's some more over here. And it's just a little like shirts and tops and dresses and stuff. that other stuff here is like work t-shirts and stuff that I actually need in pajamas. But what I'm going to do, I'm going to go through each bin, hold the things up, make sure that they are okay. If they don't fit me or I just don't need it anymore, I'm getting rid of it. So, um, I haven't really decided, I really haven't really decided how I'm going to go about like getting rid of it. Some of the stuff I do want to try to sell if it's in good quality, but other stuff is not going to get sold. It's probably just going to be given away. So either to people or to Goodwill. These are brand new shorts. So every single one of the shorts that I used to wear does not fit me anymore. Every single one. So I have a ton load of new shorts that I got from Burlington, which I'll show later in the video. So like these white pants, they're like Bermuda pants. Do not fit. Oh my gosh. This is the outfit that I had bought on my birthday or I bought for my birthday that one time. Back when I was 24, now you girl, 26. I doubt this is going to really fit me. I think my butt will be hanging out, so I'm giving that away. And this is the top that goes with it. This is definitely not gonna fit me anymore. <laughs> Here's a bathing suit top. I only wore this thing one time. It does not fit me anymore. Oh, I remember this cute thing. I think I'm gonna keep this. It's, this is not something that like, it's like a little cover up and you tie it. I think I'll keep that. I have my Slay All Day bathing suit, which I'm going to keep. I think I could get a few more wears out of this. All right, so that one is done. I only end up taking three things out of that, but that's okay. So. All right, I know there's gonna be stuff in here that I'm gonna have to keep because there's a lot of work pants in here, so. These are brand new black pants. I got them in a size, I got them in a size large because I'm getting large, child. Sweats. Yeah, these are all work pants, so it's not really interesting. I'm just gonna speed pass through this one. Times on the beat, man. All right, gym clothes. I think those are all fine. Yeah, all my gym clothes are fine. Oh, this does not fit me. I know that. This is overalls that just don't zip up anymore they're so cute though i really want to try to get one more wear out of it but they do not fit my legs the top is okay but the bottom is not so get into some more stuff oh these pants i used to love them they're from forever 21 they're a size small oh, i used to love these pants so much but they don't fit they're like wide leg at the bottom it's so fashionable and then you tie it in the front these are the shorts that i wore on my birthday last year when i went to watch lion king the remake so cute but they don't fit way too tight i like the color 
and it comes with a belt so that will jeans i haven't gotten any new jeans but i need to because this is a size three and i do not wear a size three anymore but i'd be forcing it but let me just get rid of it now so that i know not to wear it anymore times on the beat man. my favorite pair of jeans if you see me wear these you know these are like my favorite but they're getting too tight now what size are these size three all right let's move into the next bins we're in the corner now so let's go through this thing first let me go through my long sleeve clothes because i know there are some things in here that just will not fit actually let me go through this one first so there's this top i still wear this so i'm trying to figure out i'm gonna wash all these clothes again before i sell them and stuff so just fyi i remember i, wa I wear this a lot i think i'm gonna still keep it or should i give it some so a quick little top i love this black top i have yet to, oh i wore it one time it's very suede material This is like a holiday top. Love it. Oh, crop top. I'm gonna sell this. This used to be one of my favorite things to wear, but my chest is too big for it now. It's a cute crop top from Forever 21. Very nice detail. I don't know how I even got this still. Look at these little tiny shorts. I used to be able to fit in these. Obviously they were like booty shorts, but I used to be able to fit in this. I don't know how. I could use this as a rag to wipe windows. It's so tiny. What the heck? I don't usually keep things because they are memorable, but some things I am going to keep because they are memorable. I don't do it a lot for everything, but strawberry shirt that I never wore, but I bought it at a thrift shop, washed it a few times, but it's just the only thing I own that has strawberries. So I think this shirt got burned by the iron. And of course my cute little sundress here i like i love this thing here but yeah i'm gonna keep that because i'm not too big for it my lion king this is like my first lion king crop top it barely fits so i'm gonna have to give it away This used to be hung up. I don't know why it's in here. Two times on the my feet. little reindeer sweater. Keep that. My Lion King shirt. It is a bit too small, but this one is way, way too cute. I love this one because the colors and stuff. So, as I can see, I really love like character things like Lion King and Rugrats and stuff. Anything that like reminds me of like being young and free of bills so i have this peanuts top with the people on the side i like this top i'm gonna bring it back out all right let's get into something exciting i'll go back to the tops i have two more bins of tops sleeveless and regular i'm gonna go down to the bottom where i have skirts and dresses because i know for a fact some of those stuff i gotta get rid of oh it's kind of heavy too so first i have these pants so the thing is with these pants they fit me but it's hard to get this part up my thighs like it's not as stretchy as it looks when it's pulling up like i usually have to wiggle and then it fits my you know bottom and stuff very nicely 
So these are from a loft where I used to work. I miss working there and getting like a lot of teacher clothes. So I'm gonna keep that. Then we have these pants. They're flowy, cute little teacher pants. I'm gonna keep that. There's this little tie up dress or zip up dress, I, I should say. You just zip it up all the way. I don't think it doesn't kind of fit me. It's kind of like too tight. So we're gonna get rid of that. Undress. I've had this thing for so many years, but I think it's time to get rid of it. I'll probably wear it this year. I'm gonna wear it this year, okay? <laughs> okay. Now we have a rumper. I'm gonna get rid of this because I always keep this every time I do a, this little clean out session and this I never wear because it's just like, so this is it. It's super cute. I think it's from Forever 21. It has a little pant at the bottom. A, what is this? A red Forever 21 maxi skirt with a slit. I doubt I could fit this anymore because it was already tight. Look at this skinny little thing. Dang, it's very cute print too. All right, everything else can stay. I got rid of a lot of dresses, so. Let's do other skirts. I know in the other one, there's still some work pants down there, so let me get those out of the way. A little rumper, get rid of that. Mini skirt, get rid of that. This needs to go in the closet and be hung up. This is from Loft. It's a brown suede camel. This is from Ann Taylor, actually. That needs to get hung. This is the one that got burned by an iron. But I still wear it, so literally for years. Okay, so this section is done. Now we're gonna move on to things in the closet. Up here is just all of my hair products, like shampoos and stuff, so there's no clothes in there. And this is just like miscellaneous things, handbags and stuff that I have yet to get rid of as well. I actually think I'm gonna get rid of some of the handbags too, but um, this is a dress that I really love, but I think it's time to get rid of it because it's a size small. It's a white blazer. That I got from H&M. I don't think it fits me anymore. Look at the arms. <laughs> Look at that, it stops right there. I can't even, you see how tight that is? It looks like a leotard. This is a blazer, what the heck? Oh. So this, this is my birthday outfit from last year. Does not fit me anymore. I tried to wear the top the other day to do a makeup video just because you know the makeup videos is just usually from your top and up so the top literally stopped right here it's supposed to stop over here it stopped up here i could not pull it down but it's okay because the video i recorded was like literally right cut right off at this at the right time so this gotta go i know the pants don't fit me because when i did wear it last year it was really hard to get it off so i know it don't fit me it's so cute it kind of looks like pajamas but it's not and the top is, it's sad. I gotta get rid of both of these dresses. This is a really nice gold dress. It seems so simple, but when you wear it, it is like everything. That gotta go, it doesn't fit me. This doesn't fit me for sure. Very, very sentimental dress to me. I remember wearing this to my friend's wedding. I wore, I wore it to two weddings actually. It's a really nice dress. Very cute. So here's the red version of that white blazer. I don't know if this one, oh, this one fits fine. It's not as tight. I'm, I think I got this one in a bigger size. Yeah, so the red one isn't bad. I can get a few more wears out of that. Hopefully I just keep my arms from growing. This was a size four and the white one is a size, okay, the white one was a size two. This was a size four, that's what... Oh, my express dress. <laughs> My favorite little black dress, but this is a size two, honey. Oh my gosh. I'm not gonna give it away yet. Maybe I can lose weight and get back in it. 
Alright, so I got rid of a few things in the actual closet. Um, everything else seems to be okay. I already gave my little sister a lot of the stuff that I had. So yeah, this is what we're looking like right now. Those are all things I'm going to go wash. These are all bins that I need to put back over here. And yeah, let me organize the rest of my life. Yeah, I'm tired. All right, so I have all the clothes that I'm gonna either give away or sell on the bed. I'm about to go do laundry right now and wash them really good. <sighs> I'm so tired. All the ways that you can get these items will be listed right here on the screen. Somebody locally who has a young girl, size small, that just needs some new extra used clothes, I'm gonna use that way of giving that out. That's a lot. Pile. good amount so it's the next day uh, I finally got all the clothes out and washed so now I am about to steam this backdrop that I'm gonna be taking the pictures on and then I'm gonna post or I'm gonna hang each of the items onto this cute little hanger look at these hangers I got from Burlington they're like a blush pink I think it's so cute and I got my nails redone anyways I'm gonna be hanging these up after um, I steam it and then I'm going to take a picture of it really quick and I'm just going to create a nice little um, album so that I can post on my social media. Those items are going to get donated to whoever has a young girl who is about that size. So, and then the things that are like a little bit more expensive or anything like that, that I bought that is worth selling, I'm going to advertise those on like selling websites. Like I showed this before. This is like my little steamer that I got from Amazon. It's so cute. All right, so that is how I steam. It gets the, you know, creases out. And now I'm gonna start taking the pictures. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see y'all in the next video. Make sure you like and comment, subscribe if you're just watching, um, and I'll see you next time.